This crazy free Shopify dropshipping product research blueprint enables me to find 1k a day products within around about 10 minutes. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. My name is Kamil Satar, known as the Ecom King. And in this video, I'm going to be showcasing my free product research blueprint methods that enables me to find 1k a day products within around about 10 minutes. Now, the thing that I love about this strategy is number one, it's completely free. Number two, it's very simple. Number three, the these tactics have never really been used before. Some of them that I'll be showing today, nobody's ever spoken about them before. So if you're interested in these completely free new methods to do product research, make sure that you follow along with your laptop or your computer. So if you appreciate the free course worthy content on this YouTube channel, make sure you like the button, you subscribe to the channel and you turn post notifications on. And let's get straight into this crazy blueprint method. So guys, before I actually show you the free blueprint methods, I want to show you quickly some proof that this actually works. So you can see here, I'm in a student Shopify dashboard and you can see in the last seven days, he's done $1,210. Now I'm going to refresh the screen so you guys know this is real and these ain't just some draft orders and I'm also going to be showing you the draft orders too, so you know this isn't fake. So I'm going to change this to the last seven days again. So we actually started testing the product on the 28th of July. It's now the 4th of July and you can see $1,210. Now if we look at some of the individual days for this product so today it's on $49 yesterday $359 uh, the day before that 168 the day before that 235 so that just shows you that this is just a new product that we've just started testing and you can see it's starting to get some great traction now if I show you the actual draft orders just to show you that this is these ain't draft orders you can see no actual draft orders now I'm going to be showing you the first free blueprint strategy for the product research. Now the first one's going to be the free YouTube method and this method nobody else has ever spoken about it before so consider yourselves lucky today. Now as you can see on the screen I'm in a Google Doc and this Google Doc is a cheat sheet to help you through the whole process of this blueprint today and I'll be leaving it in the description as soon as we hit 3,000 likes on this video because it also tells you all the strategies how to do them and it also gives you an example of how to do them. So the first thing that that you want to do for this strategy is you want to head over to YouTube and you want to go to the search bar and I'm going to search for something like tech under 50 so I'm going to do tech under 50 and then I'm going to search for it now if you're in the tech niche this is a great way of doing it now once you've done this it's going to show you loads of different YouTube videos of you big YouTubers basically reviewing and telling their subscribers what tech they should buy under the $50 threshold now you can do tech under 20 tech under 30 you can do all of those now if you look at this video here I'm going to click it and once you click the video if you look in the description of the video you're going to see all the links to the products that this guy recommends and you can see here these are the links right here and you can see the one that stood out to me was the headphone stand charge so I'm going to click on the link and then once I clicked on the link it's actually going to take me to the Amazon page of the product and you can see it's this headphone stand with the charging ports for the phones which is really really cool now once you've done this what you want to do is you want to look for the exact same product on AliExpress because nine times out of ten anything that's on Amazon is on AliExpress so what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this bit here headphone stand with USB charger I'm going to click copy and then I'm going to head over to AliExpress and literally search for this exact same product and then once I've done that I'm going to sort it by orders and then it's going to give me the products that are related to this so you can see this one right here it's a wooden version of it and to be honest with you I prefer this one because it actually gives you a phone stand as well so I'm going to click on this link here the Aliexpress one and you can see it's a wooden one you've got the USB charge port there and you've also got a place where you can dock either three uh, phones or you can dock three iPads or whatever you want and it also has three USB chargers now if we compare that to the actual Amazon one all you're allowed to do on the Amazon one is put three USBs in there with the Aliexpress one you can also put your phone on there too and it looks really really nice so that's one great way of doing it. so I'm gonna be showing you a few different methods you can use on YouTube for different niches as well so this was one great way for doing it on the beauty niche I'll put in must-have beauty products if you search for that you're gonna see loads of different girls talking about different beauty products different things that they use different accessories they use and you want to do the same strategy again you want to go on the video go in the description and look for the Amazon and links or the links to different websites because funny enough a lot of the links in these descriptions are to drop shipping sites as well now a few other things that you want to consider is the filter thing in the top left here and you might want to filter it by the last hour the last week the last month the last year that way you're staying up to date with the products that these people are recommending so that's something that 
I personally like to do. Now I'm going to be showing you another method you can use for pet products too. So the method for the pet niche for the YouTube method could be best pet products on the search term and then you can see this video here 31 best pet products. Now unfortunately this video doesn't actually give you any links to Amazon or anything but you can literally just scroll through the video and look for the different products. Now this product right here is the bet pet pack and it's where you can put your pet in there and they can obviously see and obviously they're safe at the same time. Now what I might want to do is I might want to go to AliExpress and search for bet pack pack. So I'm going to go pet and then back pack and then we're going to see what comes up in the search results and again guys make sure you change it to the top order so i'm going to click orders again and then that will give me the products with the best order amount and you can see here this one had five thousand, but we're going to try and look for the exact same one and there you go you can see the exact same one there and if we keep scrolling down there's different versions of that so all i need to do is literally go through the different aliexpress pages and you can find pretty much the same one but for now i've seen one there one there and there's a couple of others if we click best match it might give us some other alternatives as well there's the exact same one right here so you can see when i click best match the exact same one's coming up right there so guys the second free blueprint method is actually going to pinterest go into the search bar and type in amazon must-haves and then it's going to give you loads of different pin photos of basically people posting different amazon products that they found that they consider really really good and they must have for your household so you can see this photo here i'm going to click on it and you can see if you click the actual link at the top of the actual title It'll actually take you to blogs, it'll take you to websites, but this one's taken me to a blog where it's actually a woman considering loads of different products and they've got the links in there to some of the Amazon must-haves. Now that's one way you can do it. If we go back to the Pinterest photo, if we scroll down, it'll show you suggested photos related to that one. And you can see right here, this one right here shows the teeth and we all know this is a drop shipping product and you can see right here, it's took us to a drop shipping website of the perfect smile snap on braces and we all know that this was a winning product now if we go back to pinterest again you can search for things like beauty hacks and again if you search for things like that it's going to give you products that people have used and you can see this one right here the pin roller now if i'm going to click on it then you want to click on the link and it'll take you to the pinterest or the website of that product and you can see here the natural face massage roller so guys what i'm going to try and do to find this product on aliexpress is copy the face massage roller part of this product page description and then i'm going to go to aliexpress search for the exact same phrase and then sort it by orders so you can see loads are coming up but if we sort it by order amount this one right here has had 12,589 units sold which is absolutely insane because that means it's a proven product so guys there are just a couple of ways to use pinterest to actually find winning drop shipping products now another good thing that you can do is you can search for other search terms that are related to any niche so you can do phone cases must have phone cases call phone cases and do things like that you just got to think outside the box so the third free blueprint method to find products is going on Twitter and what you want to do is you want to go to the search bar and you want to search for things like phone cases and then you want to change it to either photos or videos. They're the two that I personally use. So I'm going to go down the photo section and literally all you're looking to do is go through these different photos and try and find phone cases that you'd think could look like they're on AliExpress. Or what you can do is you can click on the photo that looks like a product, click on the profile and see if there's a link or if you click on the photo and look in the thread the thread is basically the comment section sometimes these guys will leave links in there to basically shop for because it's basically a paid influencer post so what i'm going to do quickly is look through a couple of these and come back once i find one that's actually pretty good so after looking on twitter for a few minutes i was able to find this image and this post of this person posting about these phone accessories these airpod accessories and i know in this image some of these products are winning products and i can just tell because i've seen them on aliexpress with thousands of orders so what i might want to do is i might want to go to the profile and then they normally either have a website link or another social media link so i'm gonna click on the instagram and you can see it's taken me to her instagram and it's actually a business that she owns called cases by max and you can see it's literally foam accessory products airpod products and you can see there's loads of different winning products that i've seen previously on aliexpress on her instagram so after going through her instagram for a few minutes and then going on aliexpress and trying to search for some of these products i was able to find this case here called the real dry flower glitter case and it's had 19,000 orders which is absolutely insane and this just shows that these strategies can find you some insanely great products on aliexpress so guys, the next free blueprint strategy to find dropshipping products is to go to Google and you're going to be searching for your industry biggest brands. So I'm going to be pretending that I'm in the beauty slash makeup industry. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to search for biggest makeup brands. 
Now I'll search your biggest makeup brands. What I want to do is I want to go through some of these different articles and blogs and try and go through different brands and go on their websites and then go to their best sellers. So guys, after browsing a few different articles and different blogs, I came across this blog and it ranked number 25 Sephora as one of the best makeup brands in the world. And then what I'm going to want to do is hit shop Sephora and I'm going to want to go through their best sellers. So guys, you can see I'm on Sephora. I'm going to go to all products and then I'm going to head over to best sellers. And you can see here the best seller is this lip gloss right here. So I'm going to click the lip gloss right here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and see if this lip gloss is on AliExpress or if something similar is on AliExpress. So after going to AliExpress and searching for the Sephora best seller lip gloss or lipstick, whatever you want to call it, I was able to find this one on AliExpress. It's got 12,000 orders, very good reviews, 4.7 star reviews. It comes in 12 different colors and it does the exact same thing for a lot cheaper. And this is another great way to find winning products in different niches and different industries. So that's just one example of how to use Google search, looking for the biggest brands in your industry or niche, then looking at their best sellers and seeing if you can find any drop shipping products related to that product or the exact same one on AliExpress. So the last free blueprint method to find dropshipping products is to head over to TikTok. And unfortunately, you can't do this on a laptop or a desktop. You must do this on your mobile phone. And you should see my mobile phone screen right now. You want to head over to the search section and you want to search for Amazon finds. So I'm going to type in Amazon finds and you can see right there, it heads up to the number one search term. And you can see you want to search it by tops. So you want to change it to top. And then you just want to scroll through this and you just want to look for different dropshipping products. And if we actually look on my screen right here i've just found a video and it looks like it's a balcony where you can put this thing on there and you can dry clothes you can put plants on it i'm going to click on that video right now and then what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to click on the profile where it says live favor here in the bottom left with the app and then it'll take me to their profile where you'll either have their website link or another social media link now if we actually go through this page's profile you can see it's actually a tiktok account that just promotes loads of different drop shipping products as you can see on here these are all drop shipping products and this account is absolutely massive it's got 741,000 followers which is absolutely insane and then what you guys want to do is you want to go through these different videos and search for these kind of products on aliexpress and what you can also do is you can actually go to different videos and click on the profile and look in the link section to see if they've actually got a link to a website where you can search for the product on there too so i've just gone back to the tiktok search section for amazon finds and this video right here is of another aliexpress winning product and it's a baby tooth saver and i'm just gonna let it play a little bit and you can see right there you know this is from aliexpress and what you guys want to do is you just want to go through the different search terms you can use amazon finds or you can search for things like phone cases or stuff like that and you just want to go through the tiktok search filter and you just want to find these products and search them on aliexpress and see if they're on there so those were all the crazy free blueprint product research methods that I use to find dropshipping products that can do 1K a day and above. Now that's not it for now. We need to also go over some very important factors that you must consider before going with one of these products. So the first thing is try not to sell products with over 20,000 AliExpress orders. So if we go to the AliExpress page for this product, it's got 12,000 orders, so it's under 20,000. Now the sweet spot for me is between 5,000 and 15,000. If you can get it in between that ratio, it's a great way to go. So the next important factor is check daily orders on AliExpress dropshipping center. The product should be getting five to ten percent of the total amount of orders a day. So if we go back to this lip gloss again, it's had twelve thousand orders. So we must be getting a day between five and ten percent. So ten percent of that would be one hundred and twenty. Now if we do five percent of that, it would be sixty. So we need to go to the dropshipping center right here. Now I'll be leaving a link in the description so you can access all of these tools, which are completely free. And what you want to do is you want to go to the product analysis once you've gone to the dropshipping center and you can see you put the product url in here and it will tell you the daily orders and if we look yesterday got 83 the day before that got 28 the day before that 44 the day before that 97 60 77 so you can see pretty much i would say nine times out of ten it's doing between five and ten percent of the total amount based on the daily orders, which is a great sign for us to go for when we're picking a product. So another important factor that you should consider before picking a product is going to Google Trends and seeing if there's search terms related to the product or the actual product itself are actually trending. So if we go to the AliExpress link for this product, it's the headphone stand. Now if I head over to Google Trends, you can see I've done worldwide past 90 days and I've done headphone stand, which is literally the product. And you can
can see it's currently trending. Now, I don't want to just leave it there. I also want to search for different search terms as well. So you can see here I've typed in Bose headphones because Bose are a big brand that do headphones. Now, if that topic is trending, it means head because there's no point selling a headphone stand if people are not buying headphones because it means the market is very slow at the moment. So you can see Bose headphones are currently going on an uptrend and they typically do very, very well. Then I've searched for over ear headphones and you can see it's very steady and it's always going up and down. Then I've gone for in ear headphones and the reason why I've searched for in ear headphones is because that is not related to our product. The only thing that we should be considering is over ear headphones because with a headphone stand, you can't put in ear headphones over a headphone stand. So I wanna see which is more popular, in ear headphones or over ear headphones and by the looks of things over ear headphones are more trendier which is a great thing to consider so you always want to compare search terms like that that are kind of related to the product but not actually related to it just to see if the market at the moment is steady and it's got good buying power now the last important factor that i consider when picking a product is the product needs to come with high quality images and videos so you want to look on aliexpress you want to look at amazon for the product and if it doesn't come with very good photos and very good videos i would personally not test it because that is one of the most important factors to a success with a product having good creatives. So those were the important factors to consider when picking a product. Now you don't have to have every single one of them. If you have maybe one or two of them on that list right there, in terms of important factors, that's a good sign. But let me make it very clear, you don't even have to have any of them, but it is good to have some of them just to increase the chances of success because you truly don't know how well a product's gonna do till you spend money on Facebook advertisements or any other marketing platform. So that's it for today, guys. Those were the free, crazy, untapped product research blueprint methods that you can use to find good drop shipping products let me know in the description below what you thought of today's video let me know if you guys find some really good products with these methods also let me know if you find any insanely profitable products and successful products in general i'll catch you guys on the next video